Welcome to Breaking News. We've got another great bit of news coming up for you. But first, make sure you're subscribed to Breaking News and hit the bell icon so you'll know when we post a new video. Also, after watching, join in the conversation below in the comment section. Now, here's your news. Jim Jordan drops four bombshell subpoenas, sends Biden's top two agencies scrambling. Things are heating up on Capitol Hill where Republicans are digging deeper into the Hunter Biden investigation. They want to know about any pressure from key federal authorities toward potential corruption investigations. Allegations of corruption keep growing within this investigation and Republicans want federal agents to testify what they knew about IRS whistleblower statements. What happened, what was said, and when the original investigation into Hunter Biden changed are big questions from Republicans. From the Daily Wire House Judiciary Chair Jim Jordan and House Ways and Means Chair Jason Smith subpoenaed for federal agents this week in their probe into IRS whistleblower allegations of corruption in a criminal investigation into President Joe Biden's son, Hunter Biden. Republicans believe these witnesses may shed light on why Delaware U.S. Attorney David Weiss did not initially pursue charges against Biden. Whistleblowers might have insight into the level of authority Weiss was allowed initially. Some allege that Weiss was not given final authority to prosecute Biden. Since then, Weiss was appointed as special counsel in the case by U.S. Attorney General Merrick Garland. Garland and Weiss dispute any claims of Weiss not having authority to prosecute. Jordan and Smith believe the timing and decision to appoint Weiss as special counsel stink like the D.C. swamp. A sweetheart plea deal for Biden was recently tossed from federal court and he still faces federal charges. The timing of this decision also comes after whistleblowers have raised serious and unchallenged allegations of impropriety in the department's investigation, Jordan and Smith wrote in the subpoena. The subpoena calls out two IRS officials and two FBI agents. Republicans want testimony from these individuals to shed light on inconsistent statements to Congress by Weiss and how the DOJ is handling the investigation. Hunter Biden to date has been given an easy ride compared to the criminal allegations against him. The lack of vigorous prosecution against him brings into question what Jordan and Smith have called a two-tiered justice system. Biden always seems to be one step away from walking away without any consequences and in the background there always seems to be a federal agency with officials clearing the way for him.